Hi everyone, welcome to this another video in Market Talk YouTube channel. Today we are going to see how to import option option chain from the new NSC website to Excel. It's a very simple process. Just you have to follow the steps and do it. So let's first go open the Google Chrome. Click this uh, link nsindia.com slash option dash chain. You will get this like this. Now what you do is uh, right click anywhere in this in the browser and go to inspect. Now we'll get a uh, message like this where it will show the scripts of this website. So you don't bother about anything on that. Now what we'll do is here in the top you click network. Okay now go to Excel. In the Excel you need to have power query. This is enabled in the office 2000 17 uh, 2019 and onwards so ensure or you can have office 365 or excel 365 so what you do is now go to data and there you tell from web without this power query you'll not be able to import this data that's very important okay it's a very good tool also now what we do is here we'll go here to the browser back and select here instead of bank nifty you select here now bank nifty so the script changes then you will come to know what is the changes here now what we will do is here you can see option chain indices click here okay now now let us not uh, space here save space here go here you can see here the request url now what you do is copy this uh, link control c and then go to excel now you got this message then click advanced and click here and paste control V. Now what you do is next uh, step here select here accept encoding because you give these headers parameters then only you'll be able to import the data. So what you do here come here request headers come to request headers accept encoding copy this gzip deflate only this part only you copy and then paste here then add header now language accept language come here and copy this uh, only this part en us en control c then control v add header now another one what you do is user agent user space agent okay u and a is capital and in between this uh, semi uh, dash then come here user agent you can see here and copy this here control C then control V next uh, what you do is here cookie C O O K I E cookie now in the top just here you can see cookie in this BMSV equal to okay from here we select here until equal to control C then here control V so these four things you do it then tell ok so now it will connect to the power query and then you'll be able to see the data what is there inside there are some few steps you have to just uh, blindly follow that that's it so now it's opening the power query module automatically if you do the normal excel without power query you'll not be able to do this that's very important so now the power query module is opening now what you do is uh, <coughs> Okay, it's a JSON here. Now you can see record. Click records. And then now you can see click data. Now you tell to table. Click. Now you tell OK. Now you can see some small uh, small icon like this there. Click this icon. Now you can sometimes PC may be hidden. Don't do anything. Just uh, uncheck this use original columns then tell ok now we'll get like this similarly for PE also you can get the small icon and check this all the data will get now what are irrelevant you don't interested you can uncheck this now currently for I'm just uh, selecting everything until ok now PE data all we got now go to the last column C call option now you click this icon tell ok now all the data relating to CE we got it 
anything you don't want you can later on de delete also so now all this like a macro is getting recorded now i don't want this uh, say identifier this i don't want this now you can tell remove column okay certain things will be like showing uh, the uh, values will be in the text format so what you do is select uh, all the columns now uh, for the purpose of this uh, demonstration i'll show you only open interest i'll make it as a data type whole number and here here also this p uh, open interest was what we saw now come on the right side you can see for the call what open interest here the call open interest is there now you tell here whole number okay what happens here in the open interest sometimes it will be showing a null value it is showing null value correct so for this what you have to do is select here go to transform replace values and type here null replace with zero tell okay so that all the null values will become zero because when you want to total this open interest you will not be able to do it without do this process here another way for the call what you do select the column replace values null until zero till okay so this uh, do the process for any column which have a problem like this now you tell here all done now control home close and load now close and load now the data is getting imported to excel so any columns you don't want you can just uh, remove that go to edit option and then do it so how do it edit option right click here anywhere and go to table edit query you will be able to edit the data so this way i can go back to the query and do the editing also now again we'll just go back to the close and edit now we'll see the open interest what is showing here equal to sum total okay now the total is coming to 295873 needs for all the open interest actually now we wanted for only for 23rd july so what we do is here right click table edit query in the data expiry date we will select only the 23rd july here drop down here uncheck all 23rd july select ok now we got for entire thing now expiry date also wherever it is there showing null you can do the same process of replace transform replace and you can do that also now let us go home close and load now we got only for 23rd july the data for 23rd july so you can see 187168 is the total open interest for put now we will do for call also same way so equal to sum you can see 193287 just go to this uh, option where you can now we'll close this this is not required now for bank nifty come down total open interest 187168 for put 187168 for put then for the call option 193287 193287 so this is the way you can do the import of option chain from nsc new website hope you like the video please subscribe and like the channel so that i can bring more videos for you thank you